What's good in the hood? It's your boy, Saudoris BRD, aka Brady Smalls, aka Brad James, bitch, aka Crumblin's Finest. I'm out here representing BWA, Vegas with Attitude. I'm gonna show you something today nobody has ever seen before. I'm gonna take you along on a day of a dough dealer. I was exposed to like dough or like the doji game in general, like from a very young age, you know, like I remember, I remember my mom always, you know, like making bread from scratch, like cakes all from scratch, you know, we never had anything, you know, bought outside, you know, like it was all homemade, you know what I'm saying? Like, Give a nice fresh feed to your baby mama though, because if your baby mama happy, your wallet is happy. Perfect. Just to control the height, you know, so I can see exactly when it's ready for the next step. So I knew what was good, and you know, once you you grew older, you know, you you got exposed to like all the shitty stuff. You know, what I'm saying like supermarket shit and industrial bread. You know, all that unhealthy shit. So. At one point, I just thought, you know, I had to change it. You know, like, I can't deal with it. So uh, that's when I, you know, got into it. I had it in my blood. I knew that for sure. Always remember to keep your instruments clean. Keep your kitchen clean. If your kitchen instruments clean, your product will be just perfect. In this neighborhood, you know, all the sourdough bakers and dough dealers, you know, shout out to all of y'all. Um, we're not a community, you know, like, we're family out here, you know, we take care of each other, you know, we watch out for each other, you know. This is my neighborhood, this one I'm hustling, this one I'm baking, this is my home. Spin a shit around, homie. Look at it, projects. Dangerous motherfuckers out here. Young bakers out here dying every day, eating all these fucking products. Store-bought bread, badass flour, dirty-ass water, I ain't done with that. This is out here, it's bake or die, homie. This right here, that's that real shit. To all them young bakers and home cooks out there, making all that shit with all this instant powder fucking yeast. Fuck all of y'all. This, real Brady S'mores, real shit. See that? You can smell the difference. Right, I'm gonna add some, some flour right now. I have to cut it, you know, I mean, it's fucking strong. It's sour as fuck. I mean, if I give this straight, bake this straight up and give it to all them bread heads out there, oh, man, motherfucker's gonna be in carb coma in no time. I, ain't, I don't want that. Get your hands in it. I know all them young cats out there, oh, I don't want to get dirty and all that shit. Fuck all of y'all, man. But get your hands in it. You need to feel your product. That's how you can build like, like relationships with, you know, you know what you know what's all about. You can feel it. And if you feel your product, that's when you're going to be really good at what you do. And like, you know, like these days, you know, people from all over the world, you know, like DMing me on Instagram and all that, telling me how great my, my bread looks, you know, asking me all kinds of things, like what kind of flour I'm using, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm ready to help, you know, like, you can ask me anything you want. They call me Vincent Van Doe. I mean, like, I'm an artist, you know. It, I guess that speaks for itself. Nice bubbles around here. It's a good sign. Now we add the salt. Now 
important. Stretch and fold. Stretch and fold. All right, man, we're gonna do some like a bread delivery. I'm meeting one of my special customers. I've known him like for, for years now. Oh, it's dangerous, you know, because it's like one of those neighborhoods I'm not allowed to be in, you know, like this instant yeast boys run these streets, but, you know, gotta take some risks these days, you know, I wanna get paid. Beautiful, last uh, stretch. Slap it up. See all those little bubbles? If you got those, it's always a good sign. Give it a stretch. Grab around under it, fold it over. Grab under it, fold it over. Turn around, look. Bop! In this baby. See that? Spin that shit around, you know. Beautiful, nice and airy and soft. Wrap it up and into the fresh it goes until tomorrow. I am the dope kingpin of this neighborhood and that shit ain't gonna change, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't going nowhere. I usually start my day fresh, you know, it's early in the morning. Most bread heads get baked from smoking pot, but I bake my bread and I'm smoking hot hot, you know what I'm saying? Like, this shit is piping hot. Gotta watch out. All right, all right. Looks great, looks good. You know, just give it a nice, deep cut. Cut it up. Add it in. Give it a final score once again. Put the lid on. And back to the oven she goes. Alright man. In a way, you know, with my special customer. It's been a loyal cat for years, you know, I've known him for a long time. Hey man, when we get to the point, I want you to put your camera down, alright? I don't want you to, to film any of this. I don't want anybody to see him, I don't want anybody to see like the whole fucking action, alright? Ready to put your camera. I said put the fucking camera down. What the fuck is wrong with you? Put it down. Alright. The loaf is done. Look at it. Perfect, nice golden color. You gotta make some dough for some dough, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's the game. That's how I get paid. You have to be clever about like when and where you go. You know what I'm saying those cops on, on low carb diets, you know, they're mad as fuck. You know, they're just waiting to put your ass in jail. I usually say, like, if your bread is crusted, you won't get busted. Don't go anywhere. I had to, you know, run up on cars to sell my shit, but these days I run on carbs. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you treat the game right, the game is gonna treat you right. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's hand for hand. Left every door, deal, you know, like the cruise around my neighborhood, check on my corner bakers, you know, see how they do. Like, Who the fuck is this, man? What the fuck is going on? Hey, man, wait here, wait here, wait here. What the fuck you doing out here, huh? Told you to stay out of my neighborhood, homie. Yes. 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 Tell your crew. Tell your crew. Let's roll, let's roll, let's roll. Let's go. The fuck you? Get in. You know, like in these blocks around here, you know, they they straight up divided. You know, it's us sourdough bakers, dough dealers, 
and then you got like the Mercedes motherfuckers, you know, they down the block, you know, we can go there and they can come here, you know what I'm saying? Like, but every now and then, and, you know, like situation tensions up. If y'all ain't ready, you want some fucking sour though. Don't come in this game. Don't come in. Don't come here. Don't, you are not ready. My advice to all them young dough dealers out there, you know, trying to make a name for, a name for themselves. Learn how to stretch and fold, you know, like, you gotta love the gluten. You know what I'm saying? Develop it, you know, embrace it, and put your money on sourdough. You know, instant years ain't got no fucking future. Fuck instant years. I, use, I always say it, like, and all this fancy shit, like, keto diet and, and gluten-free diet, and fuck all of you, man. You're gluten-free, motherfuckers. Y'all stabbed me. You tried to kill me. And guess what? Brady Smalls is still here. I run these crumbling streets. And these streets, these streets are either big or die.